Want to add a new rental in Booking Sync? Easy. From the rental section on your account, just click on New Rental. Then enter the name for this new rental. The rental type, the number of slips and slip max, which includes additional guests, the area and the unit, the stories and floor number if needed, your permit or res registration number depending on your location, number of bedrooms and bathrooms, and click on Add Rental. Here you will find your new rental at the bottom of your list. Here at any time you can find what is missing to publish your rental. Click here to continue. You can fill the details for the bedroom and the bathrooms. Then you need to enter a headline, a summary and a description. Don't forget to click on save for each screen. Then jump on the location. The advertising location is mandatory. Here you can go down from the continent, the country, the region, department and uh, area. Then fill your address and save. You need to pick some amenities. Save. Not that you can add details for each amenities. Then you need to add some rates, at least a base rate. You can add the minimum rate as well, which is the selling rate for which your property will be sold. The down payment, if it's not the default percentage. You can also add the damage deposit, choose the rounding kind and change the balance to date. Here, to publish your property, you need at least one period to apply the rates. The base rate is not enough. You can add as many seasons as you like. Here, I will just create one big season. Pick the ratio of the base rate or add a rate directly. And don't forget to select the minimum stay for this season. Here, click on Create. You can add some rate rules if you like, public note, or choose a rate table. Then, jump into Photos. You need to add pictures for your properties. You can add also some videos. For the rental agreement, this is the default rental agreement, the one that is in setting payment that is taken here but you can overwrite this information. Same for the cancellation policy. And last, you can add fees and services amongst your catalog. So don't forget to create the fees and services before. Same for the taxes. And last, in your private tab, Private means that this information is not shared with anyone. You can add the owner information, owner agreement, add some tags for the properties, some not, the check-in details and check-out details, and the payment gateway if you want to use a payment gateway for your online payments. That's it, five minutes.